The frontline workers, many, many are taking it. I happen to be taking it. I happen to be taking it. Hydroxychloroquine? I'm taking it. Hydroxychloroquine. Right now, yeah. A couple of weeks ago, I started taking it. Because I think it's good. I've heard a lot of good stories. And if it's not good, I'll tell you right, I'm not going to get hurt by it. It's been around for 40 years for malaria, for lupus, for other things. I take it. Frontline workers take it. A lot of doctors take it. Excuse me. A lot of doctors take it. I take it. The White House, did the White House doctor recommend that you take that? Is that why you're taking it? Yeah, White it? House doctor. I didn't recommend. No, I asked him, what do you think? He said, well, if you'd like it. I said, yeah, I'd like it. I'd like to take it. A lot of people are taking it. A lot of frontline workers are taking hydroxychloroquine. A lot of front, I don't take it because, hey, people said, oh, maybe he owns the company. No, I don't know the company. You know what? I want the people of this nation to feel good. I don't want them being sick. And there's a very good chance that this has an impact especially early on. But you look at frontline workers, you look at doctors and nurses, a lot of them are taking it as a preventative. Explain, sir, though, you, what is the evidence that it has a preventative effect? Here we go, you ready? Here's my evidence. I get a lot of positive calls about it. But I get a lot of tremendously positive news on the hydroxy, and I say, hey, you know the expression I've used, John? What do you have to lose? Okay, what do you have to lose? Every so I have, been, medicine? I have been taking it for about a week, week for about a week and a half. Every day? At some point, every day. I take a pill every day.